praises when praises go up. Blessings come down when praises go up. Blessings come down. Hallelujah. Come on. Hallelujah. 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 Amen. God bless you. Amen. We thank God for all of you who are here today. Amen. Touch your neighbor's hand. Father, in Jesus' name, strengthen us today as we deliver your word to bless your people. The most important part of every service is your word. Heaven and earth shall pass away, but your word will stand forever. Strengthen my feeble knees, Lord. Touch these lips of clay. Give me what to say. I pray that you will be in me, with me, around me. Father, forgive us all of our sins and thought were to be. Stand up in this Holy Ghost and let us say it was glad for us to be here to hear your word. In Jesus' name, amen. Certainly, we praise God for all of you who are here today. Wonderful uh, blessings go towards the Lord for his wonderful mercy that he's given to us. We honor the Spirit of Christ who uh, is the head of my life. God, on the answer to the praise reports of Sister Sheila, Minister Sheila Mathis, uh, that our own precious uh, Pastor Stephen Benjamin, our pastor in uh, Connecticut uh, received uh, a stint in his heart on Friday and um, he asked us to pray for him and uh, all is well he's doing good he came home on the next day amen leaping and praising God thanking God for the victory they released him said it was just a wonderful procedure he just continued to pray for his healing somebody say amen. amen so that was a great praise report for also for Mother Edwards we praying for her that God will give her 100% strength. And I, I told Co Pastor her birthday next month, so she's going to be real good. She just resting up for her birthday coming up next month. She's going to be here in grand style in her white, her big hat, her outfit, her pocketbook. She's going to wear this step in for her birthday. And you know that you know, my mother and father, Evans, uh, but Tate, you know, they would sit 29 days in every month. You know, I was to take them. To, to the doctor and stuff, and on, on the first of the month, they got healed. Some of them got that check. That check came in the mail. I took in the Riggs bike, and Mama, I'll stop by that McDonald's going on Georgia Avenue, get me a, a fish sandwich, and amen, get me a fillet fish and, and some fries, and, and they got healed every first of the month. Something about the inspiration of, somebody say amen. Amen, and the only person that, Amen. Talking about money ain't no good, ain't got nothing. Somebody say amen. Yeah, that's, that's, the, that's the word. That's the person talking. Ain't no good, ain't having nothing, ain't got nothing. Amen. Uh, Steve Hawk said, I, I, I'd rather um, be saved and have something than not save and have nothing. Somebody say amen. 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 So uh, I thank God for all of you. My good friend of 40 years is here today. Uh, Brother Keith Tate, give God another hand. He, that's my friend. We were like this, 12, 11, 12 years old growing up. I was to go over his house and we eat chicken every Sunday, watch the Redskins, win Super Bowls back in that day. And uh, I, I love him so, so much. You know, uh, there's a confidant, and we talk about that. Those are, there are few of those throughout your life. Then comrades are people who you, um, you, you meet and they're fighting against what you're fighting against. Uh, and then there's, um, there's one more seat in there, and conf confidants, comrades, and I, think I got the other one in my, my phone. But, uh, you know, when you have friends, friends who will be with you down through the years, you honor those relationships. Somebody say amen. amen. And we thank God for, for Brother Keith Tate. He's just speaking up on me. Man, I love you. Give God another hand for him. You want to see your take praise report, Keith? Come on, you just came from out of town, man. Amen. Every, everything gives me another time to, for a break. Amen. Um, well, we're getting ready to go to the Word. I want to give you something to think about from Isaiah chapter 40, verse 31. Mr. Randolph, you want to sing something again, sir? You always bless me, man. You know, it, it gives me, you know, it, it, you know when, when, when y'all come and take the mic for a minute, it's like a boxing match. It gives me two more minutes, you know, to go to, the, to that stop. And then I, I, I hear when I go over and sit down, 
the hype man said, come on, Evans, you can do it. Come on, Evans, you can do it. The hype man's hyping me up when I said, the Holy Ghost hyped me up. Come on, you can do it, you can do it. And then I hear I hear the coach saying, come on, man, you got to go to the left. You got, you got, you got 30 minutes. I hear the coach talking, man. And then, then, then I hear the, the other person's cleaning me off, you know, wiping all the mud and the stuff off my face. The cleanup man. Somebody say, man. So you got three people in your corner, but you only got about 30 seconds, 60 seconds to get it together. Amen. So come on up here while I get it together. Come on, give God another hand for Come on, Mark. Mark can play anything. You can sing. Amen.